learning or like apply what we're learning Off about right now to some algebra stuff you did in your previous Off analysis, right? Conjecture. So I don't even know what that on, is. Um, your prior knowledge of algebra, which you may or may not actually remember, right? So let's take a look at 43. Use the table to make a conjecture about the relationship between x and y. Then write an equation for y in terms of x. Use the equation to test can get us a rebound, you know. Okay, so basically wants you to look at the table here and find the pattern. So bad. Right? If that's a conjecture. Conjecture is, you know, what what can we conclude about this based on our observations? So we're looking for a pattern to make a conclusion. And there's actually a couple different patterns here you can make. Oh, you're fucking yeah, I still. Um, or a couple different patterns you can recognize. But one it is. pattern you might notice is that the Y is adding three. Oh my gosh, fucking sweat. Right? For each time that X is adding one. His brother was playing in the beginning. So one conjecture is as x increases by one. He brought his brother to finish off the job. Three or something along those lines. Hmm. All right, so that's one option. And then if you remember back to your algebra days, that means that this is a linear equation. Okay, we. We very briefly reviewed the equation y equals mx plus b at the beginning of the year. We need so more bigger guys. You guys dealt with that a lot in your algebra no, class. Can't be the fucking this is linear we need because it's a time forward and change, right? It's adding the same thing over and over again. That's what um, m is, right? M or the slope is that constant rate of change. This is just one game. So here our slope is three. We're struggling still, but this is one game. Because deals it's first, adding, you know. Rise over run would be three over one. It's adding three each time. And then B is our. Y Why is she test. fixing our tone every five seconds? Where X is zero. So that's the easiest way to do this problem, but it relies heavily on um, remembering some algebra stuff. So if you forgot some of that, no big deal. But that's um, one way to write the equation. Our conjecture was that Hard as time. x increases by 1, y increases by 1. And when it says use the equation to test your conjecture for the values of x, that means that just means, well, test it out and make sure your equation works. If x is 5 and you plug that in here, 3 times 5 is 15, 15 plus 2 is 17. Does that still follow the pattern? Sure enough, it's 3 more than 14. Right? And if I plugged in 6, I'd have the same result. 3 times 6 is 18. 18 plus 2 is 20. Sure enough, that's 3 more than 17. So it's following that. No one has a camera on. Um, any, any other questions on the assignments? I do want to apologize for any confusion none of you guys said anything but i realized late last night that i forgot to put the due dates on the assignments um they were published on canvas for you and i told you about them at the end of class but i forgot to put the due dates so if that messed you up and you didn't realize that 2.1 and 2.2 were due today i apologize for that you can still get One. those done okay. it was due um, today i don't care okay. she didn't say anything it's her fault all she right. just said you can do it today. Uh, okay. See. Do we have any announcements before we start our lesson? I guess just a reminder that. My gosh, try hard. Um, the progress reports come out on Friday. So please check your grades on Canvas. Let me know if you notice anything that needs to be updated or if you have any questions or concerns there. Um, yeah, otherwise, I think we're ready to start our lesson. Okay, you have to take uh, notes. I know. Do you guys have any questions for me before try we start? Try hard, try hard, try hard, try hard. Um, 2.3. Shoot that sharp. 